Welcome back to MTFC TV. Jeremy, this time is Roger Craig Elliott. Craig, 3 0, aggression into the next round. You must be happy, man, this evening. Yeah, we did what we had to do. Um, so it's nice to get a clean sheet. It's even nicer to sort of win a game of football. Um, I don't think we ever looked in sort of danger sort of today. Um, and then we scored two terrific goals in the second half from Jordan, so really pleasing. Going into the first half, I know when the lineup came out, a lot of people looked at it and said, oh, there's a few missing. I from my perspective, I thought the lads that came in today stepped up and really put a case forward for themselves. Um, yeah, I'm not sure who was missing, to be fair, but um, I thought it was pretty much the same team as what um, we've had for previous weeks. I think we're like four unbeaten now, I lost one in six, so we're on a decent run, um, scoring goals, um, clean sheets, so yeah, um, really happy. Uh, you mentioned Jordan Barney, two outstanding goals today. Having a player of that quality you'll see must be a real good thing to have as a manager? Yeah, I thought um, I thought he wasn't as um, effective today as what he has been in other games because I've got really high standards of him. He's a, he's a top player, but then he uh, scored two amazing goals and I thought last 20 minutes he absolutely run the show. Um, his energy levels are really good. It's, you know, his fitness is where it should be at. Um, I want the rest of the team to be like that as well. Um, and you can see the quality today. We're very lucky to have him. He can play numerous positions and uh, really pleased for him today. We've seen the defence again keep a clean sheet. That's something we've now seen a few times with you at the helm. Is it something you uh, feel very important to build your teams apart? Well, I think the teams have always been built on a solid foundation, sort of keeping clean sheets. I think when you keep clean sheets, it's obvious to say, but it gives you a big chance of winning games of football. So, um, yeah, we've done that. It's nice to have sort of the skipper back, Qualtz, today. He's done brilliant, um, along with a few others. Um, special mention to Mark Lees as well, who played injured. Um, so, the character of the lads is never in question, and I'm really pleased for the result. Into the hat for the next round now. I know we, we don't know all the scores today. Is there anybody in particular you would quite fancy test yourself against? No, not at all. I'm not too interested really. Like I said, it's just another game today. We want to win. We want to try and keep us unbeaten as long as we can. Um, we park that now when we go on to the next league game on Tuesday. Speaking of Tuesday, and I feel like we have this conversation on a weekly basis. The word signings again coming up. I know there's a lot of work been going on behind the scenes. Where are we at with that at the minute? Well, I think there's a, there's a couple already agreed. We tried to get them done yesterday, but unfortunately the club couldn't get them done for whatever reason. Um, so, yeah, hopefully they're in for Tuesday, but it's no massive deal. Um, we're in a good place in the league. We're on a good run of games, uh, of, of unbeaten, so um, there's no, ma no massive panic. Um, and it gives lads an opportunity to come in, and I thought Jerome Slew coming today and were excellent. Coming on to Tuesday now. Liversidge, they are currently, I believe, at the bottom of the table, but we know how competitive a league it is. How do you prefer, uh, prepare sorry, your players for that sort of game? Well, I think it's about preparing for this league. I think you, we all know this league, anybody can beat anybody on the day. Um, you could throw a blanket over probably 14, 15 teams in this league. So um, you've seen Whitby pick up in the last few weeks, and I'm sure Liversidge will. They still have some very dangerous players, some good players, a good management team there. So I'm under no illusion it's going to be another tough game. Thank you for your time. Right. Congratulations, Craig. Cheers.